So, I mean, the network of the future um, that we're going to talk about as part of this webinar, though, um, I, I really want to focus on a couple things. Um, one, we have this inflection point in the industry where we're seeing Wi-Fi 6 being rolled out. Um, so some people will probably adopt uh, a large chunk of Wi-Fi 6 capable devices this year. Some people, it won't be three years. Um, you know, it won't be, it will be up to three years from now that we'll see in the environment uh, a plethora of Wi-Fi 6 devices. Kind of depends on your refresh there. But at that point, we need an infrastructure that's prepared to handle that. And there's a ton of great benefits that come with Wi-Fi 6. Um, you know, throughput obviously being uh, chief amongst those. Um, but several other things in support of IoT devices and managing the current 2.4 gig spectrum. Um, and so we just expect a much better, very close to wired experience with this next generation of wireless. Mm -hmm. the, the challenge for us is on a per AP basis, we need to drive more than a gigabit of traffic on that link. Um, so Cisco has partnered um, with industry folks and, and come up with this new standard called MGIG that allows us to push more traffic. Um, so we wanna talk about kind of the architecture that goes with that. But uh, as we kind of transition to this new uh, you know era in our industry with Wi-Fi really becoming almost equivalent now uh, to wired, uh, there are some changes uh, in the infrastructure that we need to plan for. So we wanna talk a little bit about that. Um, I also want to bring our uh, security lead in because uh, there's so many threats out there now. The more that we can do with our infrastructure um, to monitor traffic um, that is traversing to protect our infrastructure um, as far as who, who has access um, to our infrastructure and being able to manage all of our security policies uh, you know, in one place um, is something that is becoming priority number one for most organizations. So I love to talk route switch and throughput and how we can get people on the Wi-Fi, um, but security almost needs to be the first part of that conversation. Um, so we'll outline a couple of the tools that Cisco um, is developing and has in place uh, that we can do to, or that we can use to, to bring about that security, uh, as well as some of the changes that are coming uh, from Wi-Fi 6.